Continuing with our cognitive uh, cognitive distortions and biases uh, playlist, number four is the groupthink bias. There's actually a couple things at work here. Um, one is the so-called uh, us versus them uh, distortion or the, the in-group distortion where you think that members of your group, uh, whatever that group is, your bowling team, um, your nationality, your religion, whatever group you conceptualize yourself as being a part of, they're automatically better than any group that is not your group. You have to be aware of the group think um, bias because sometimes your group is not better than the other group. Uh, sometimes what you've conceived of as a, a group that you belong to or a, a, a set is not um, actually a set. Or you can be... Uh, you can have a, a frame forced on you where you're told you belong to a certain group that you uh, you don't feel. Um, the other uh, aspect of the group think it, bias that you fall prey to is inside that group, not only the uh, us versus them, this is my group, that's your group. In the group, you will tend to fall um, victim to whatever the dominant um, outlook of the group is. So it's very difficult to... Uh, stand up to someone and speak your uh, your truth or your peace or your present your argument I guess I want to sound too uh, too uh, woo woo there uh, but in the group <clears throat> that you feel that you belong to is even more difficult right it's harder to say no to uh, I disagree to members of a group you feel like you belong to so you have ten people and nine of them are saying that the sky is red. Um, and you, you can see clearly that it's blue, uh, you'll just say it's red and go along with it because that's a predominant thought in the group. That is a cognitive, very common cognitive distortion, and you have to be aware of that, that you're just going along with the group because that's um, the dominant thought in the group. Uh, be self-aware. Be somewhat assertive. I mean, don't be an ass. Sometimes when nine people say something is a certain way, you have to consider the preponderance of evidence and check yourself first. But if you've done that, you've rationalized, state clearly, even if you disagree with the group, beware of groupthink. Uh, it's, a, it's a great way that we are uh, civilized uh, by those that benefit from the process of civilization. So you have to watch this. Also be aware of that in-group, out-group mentality. It's very natural, <clears throat> but it can lead to a uh, lead you into a groupthink bias. All right, so um, consider that one for a little while.